didn't start it on the roof. So we had to rip this entire roof off down to the beams and put uh, plywood. This is gonna be the White House, right? They did the garage roof also. Garage roof is looking nice. So I got the approval for the variants and I got the approval from the historical board to replace the wood windows with vinyl windows and to fix the uh, front porch. All right, we at the White House. We're trying to push to get this project done. We got the back wood here. These guys are doing some work to the exterior of the property. Now, this came out really, really nice. Check it out. This is my Victorian project. I'm so proud of this. I'm trying to take my time and make sure it comes out magnifico. This is a nice restoration. Still got some work to do, man. I'm trying to fight to get this thing on the market, but oh man, it's whatever. Every day we working, so it's pushing, moving forward. Excited about that. But now we're actually running the um, the underground drainage system for all of the leaders and, you know, the exterior water. About to install a fence. The fence just was delivered. Create some privacy back here. And then uh, we're gonna do a cement patio back here. So, you know, pop a garage door in and pay it the driveway. So we're pushing, trying to get this thing done, man. Coming along, coming along. Trying to get this deck done. Well, the patio actually. Then we'll do the fence. All right, so it's kind of late. Well, not that really late, but we're gonna check on one of the renovation projects that I'm working on. This is the White House here. Um, it's, uh, we're about maybe two months behind in this project. It was supposed to be on the market. We did all we could, all we could do. We pushed as much as we could, but we still fell behind. But now we have a night crew in here. We're working night and day to make it happen. Uh, the whole goal now is to try to get this house on the market before Christmas. So we'll see. This is good. This is a major job here because all the ceilings was like plaster. So we're gonna bring it back. I got the right guy in the job, and I was gonna make it original. So you guys, we're getting started with the kitchen. I'm pretty excited. For the oven wall, and the architect who joins the oven wall, this come out. So it's not gonna come here, so. Um, I have to have the electrician stop by and cut that yeah, out. Uh, what is this? Some of these are under like cabinets. Some of those are the, they go under for the light underneath. Okay. Uh, okay. So he has to bring that down to their outlet there. So I have to call him and let him know. Right, this is the second floor uh, bathroom wall. Remember, we're doing the whole entire wall. All right, so yeah, this is the third floor of Victorian. We're actually doing a lot of skim coat. This takes a lot of time to do. And um, we're trying to complete it as much as, as fast as we can to try to get it done and keep the same quality. So sometimes it takes a little bit more time, but we gotta get it done. Just did a quick walkthrough. Had to check with the carpenter who was fixing the cabinets. Had to check with my guy who was doing all the spackling, trying to make all the walls even. Uh, spoke to the ceramic tile guy. They're gonna be over here tomorrow doing the tile in the basement, second and third floor, so. This is a lot, but this is what you have to do to stay on top of the project. This was a really, really big project. It's taking longer than I expected, but the quality of this is gonna come out so good. Can't wait for you guys to see it, the White House. All right, we back at the White House. It's crunch time. Get this thing on the market. We're about five weeks away. 
We have a uh, kitchen almost complete. Coming together. These type of projects, you have to put extra, extra into it. I think this is gonna be the best kitchen to date. Put these new, keep the old look of the house. Always trying to restore into the original format. Kept all the original moldings. Restore what I could with floor moldings. Even the ceiling was worked to keep that arch in the ceiling. And restore that. Still got some work to do up there. Basement came out nice too. We're still coming up. Together we have a four sump pumps down here. This section over here in the basement. Nice room for a pool table, a weight, a little mini gym. Trying to reuse as much original as I can. It's gonna be a closet door. Got a 36 closet door in this room. Keep all the same style. Just coming together, coming together. And then the third floor even have a different pattern. This is the fun part, guys. Restorations. <laughs> Restorations. You gotta save these original moldings as much as you can. I mean, you save money and you keep the original look at the house. Floors are pretty good, so we're gonna bring these floors back. Believe it or not. All right, we're back at the White House. This is the old Victorian. Yeah, this is a lot of detail work that went into this project. This is the foyer section. And we have a nice staircase here. And this is a very large Victorian. And trying to restore it to its original is challenging. It's fun though, also. It's, it's challenging, but it's actually fun. The creativity that goes into it to try to match the missing moldings and everything else. So I say most of the time spent on a project like this in the moldings, trying to restore the moldings. Kitchen. Get started on this. We just got started on the kitchen. At the final stages. This is the back staircase that leads to the master bedroom. This is the master suite. And right off of it, in the same room is the bathroom. The bathroom over here. Double vanity. Something is not right. All right, so I just discovered this. They just built this is for the refrigerator, it's a cabinet. But this light has to move over a little bit. That's good anyway, because this whole row should be back further. It's Victorian, this is the White House. I'm excited getting this done finally. Then we just gotta pay the driveway. And we good to go. <laughs> All right, so cabinets, tile guy just finished the tile. Everything's coming out very, very nice. <laughs> Everybody in training. Everybody working. Everybody working. Finally, this is about a two week process. And it's still maybe another two more days to be fully cured, but. Came out really nice. This is the White House. Pushing to the finish line. And they do the floor is really dark.
white porch. <laughs> this project uh, was about 14 months. This was a complete restoration. Oh man. So we got the farm sink. 48 inch range. Wine cooler. Did another sink in the island. 36 inch fridge. We were able to restore a lot of the molding, but a lot of this mold in the kitchen, well actually all of the mold in the kitchen is brand new. All right, finally, we're back at the White House. We are finally, finally, finally done. Just wanna give a big shout out to all of my investors who waited so patiently for me to finish this project. We just put it on the market. Uh, we had the first open house yesterday. Did very, 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 very well. We had a lot of foot traffic. I'll show you guys the finished results. Come take a look inside with me. Now this was a project that really took a lot of work and effort because we had to restore all of the original moldings. This house had a lot of character and we wanted to make sure we captured that. Thank you.